Do you guys like rainbows? I really like rainbows. And I also really like droppers. And I, wait, 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 wait a second. Wait, there's something, hang on. There's something missing in this video. There's something missing before I start. Hold on, what? Oh, there we go. We're good. You know, we're just missing an eyeball. I gotta make sure my microphone can see what I'm doing. Anyways, guys, welcome back to another video. My <gasps> <laughs> surgery, 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 surgery. <gasps> it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. Okay, I think we're ready, guys. Welcome back to another video. My name is Unspeakable, and today we're playing a dropper map. It's been a little while since I've played a dropper map, but what the flip are we doing? Let's get straight into it. Level number one, a pretty world. So you guys seem to like dropper maps on my channel. I personally don't know why. I think it's because I am uh, terrible at them, and I just, I hit everything. Or maybe because I'm really good at them, and I can probably make this on my first try. Oh, I- Wait, there's no water down there. There must be a hidden slime block. You know, that would have been actually really cool if I would have made that on my first try. But hey, second try is the charm. You know, I felt like there was a slime block under that carpet. Okay, there we go. All right, so <laughs> that is <laughs> level one. I have no idea how many levels there are in this map. Okay. Yeah, I guess this is, this is kind of the menu. What is this? Level all the way to level eight. Uh, there's level. There's eight levels. Eight levels. I love this like whole rainbow theme. Like I hope all the levels are rainbow. I don't think this one's gonna be rainbow. It says it's a snowy abyss. Oh well. Step number one to being a successful dropper player: look at the dropper and become one with the dropper and slam your face into something. Step number three: if you can't find the water. Do a 360 and YOLO it, and you might find the water. Step number four, just breathe and believe. Breathe and believe. There, hey, there's water up there at the top, but that was glass. That was tricking me. Breathe and believe. Okay. Step number seven, make it on your fifth try, or maybe your sixth try, or your seventh try, or, you know, or not make it. Step number eight, or step number seven, or step number 562. Step number 1,552,672. Step number 2,750 flip. Step number flip, jump down, make sure you have a super dramatic scream like this. And make it into the water just like so. Well, that level was uh, pretty interesting. Hopefully, I have taught you guys how to be a professional dropping expert. Now, let's go back to the levels room. Level three was unlocked. Go ahead and press start here. Level three is a castle. Okay, what have we got going on here? Looks like this is kind of a difficult drop we got going on here. I'm not really sure where to drop either. I think I'm just going to try right here. Oh. Oh, uh, I'm trying. I don't know that this one looks pretty difficult. It looks like you have a lot of options and first you got to land in a one by one block or you got to be lucky and hopefully land. That is hard to land through that. That is pretty tedious. It's almost like landing in a cauldron. Like, come on, who's actually going to land in a flipping cauldron? I think I see some water right there and right there. Okay, where should I drop after this? Okay, I should go more forward. Okay, hang on. I just, you just gotta memorize the map. You know, that's step number 1052. Memorize your opponent. Know where he goes, know where he sleeps. And memorize every block to ever exist. I feel like there's an easier way. Let me see if we can try dropping down this one. Never mind. Alrighty, folks. Okay, so it looks like there's some water right there. I honestly, I think I got this. I think I got this. One way to do it is to jump off and land in this little one by one hole and do a 360, turn all the way around and then land right in the, the what you think is water, but it's actually glass. Go ahead and dive off, land in this little one by one hole and honestly, don't even focus on the water. Who needs water? Just make sure you land in a cobweb and you'll be good. Not too bad of a level. Let's go ahead and go over to level four. Level four was unlocked. Uh, and I also got a new achievement, which is night. <laughs> I guess that's because I defeated the castle. <laughs> Level four is city. It looks kind of colorful. I'm honestly, I'm really hoping there's more like rainbow levels in this dropper. I'm sure there is. I hope it wasn't just the first level. Um, but ooh, whoa, this looks ridiculous okay it doesn't look like there's really any obstacles that we have to avoid looks like we just kind of have to find the water okay so it looks like there might be water okay so i see water over there 
All right, so let me hit a 360 and hopefully... Oh, I was so close! Hit a quick little 360 real quick and... Uh, what? All right, jumping off the helicopter, gonna pull a quick little 360 and I'm still gonna make it where I'm supposed to. All right, not too bad of a level. <laughs> this level's huge. It's like, find the bu- Oh, there it is. Okay, I was about to be like, do I have to really look through all these buildings to try and find the button to go back to the level's room? Okay, level five was unlocked. Oh, nausea. Oh, 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 is that right? Okay, let's see if this level- Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. It's actually given us- the, oh my gosh, this is absolutely terrible. Okay, it doesn't look like that hard of a level though, I will say, because I can see the, I can see the end. I think the trick is, is you really gotta get going on this level right before the nausea gets really, really bad. Oh my gosh, I'm so nauseous, stop! Stop doing this to me. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, flip. This is probably going to be the hardest level yet because I have never done a dropper on an effect like this. Oh, my gosh. Okay, I need to jump more towards the middle. I'll stay kind of towards the middle here. Oh, okay. I got to avoid that, though. I wonder if I'm in F5, does it still give me... Oh, yeah. It's okay. All right. Yeah, I, that was a dumb question. Unspeakable. Okay, okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, flip! I love how it puts the glass here so it waits till, like, the the effect gets really bad on you. And then it's like, oh, go ahead, pal. Okay, let's try the other side. Let's try this side. Now that I got my eyeball on, my microphone should be able to see. So I think we should be able to make it. See, that wasn't too bad. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna wait until the sl- I'm not gonna touch anything because I don't know what the flip is going on. Oh my gosh, that was incredibly difficult. Level six is unlocked. All right, there we go. And then we only have, I guess, two more levels unless there's a bonus level. A lot of these dropper maps will have bonus levels, guys. So I wouldn't be surprised if there's some crazy rainbow bonus level coming up ahead um okay i don't see any water on this level oh there it is there it is oh i almost made that on my first flip and try wait what is this lever over here what is this oh what is this you hiding secret things from me oh congratulations you found the sheep thank you very much i didn't know i would ever live a day to see a magical hidden sheep okay 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 I've gotten so close to the water every time. This is my third try. There it is. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Whoo! 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 Level seven. The yellow room. I'm assuming everything is going to be yellow. Banana, 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 banana. This level actually looks kind of hard. I cannot see anything. Oh, don't you see? I hate levels that do that. We got to make it through like a little one by one, but you got to go like all the way to the edge. Like we got to go all the way over here first. And then we got to pull ourselves all the way over here. Oh, this is ridiculous. This is, I think this is going to be the hardest level yet here goes something yeah oh flip that tricked me here goes something part two here goes something part three i feel like i can't make this because of something it's either one you guys haven't hit the like button or it's this eyeball i feel confident that i can make it now you know this yellow world has never been too much for me oh <gasps> what I was trying to go over- What? I was- What? What the fuck? I was literally trying to go over to the water, but I didn't have enough time to go over. Turns out, I- There was a slime block under there, and the water's actually fake. Is the other water? The other water's fake, too. Oh my gosh, what are the flipping odds? See the eyeball, okay? Sometimes it doesn't give me the best luck. Level 8 is called System. It looks like there is, uh, gonna be a lot of redstone in this one. Okay, this looks interesting. The heck is going? Oh, it's one of those. I hate these type of levels. I seriously really do not like, like the levels that change. Oh, it's literally the worst because you have to time it. You literally have to time it. And I hope there's not more to time after this. Like that's going to be really bad. 
Oh, flip. Yeah, okay. Turn red, turn red, now turn green. I'm, I'm kidding, though. These levels are actually pretty cool. This is actually a really cool dropper level. What the flip is going on after that? All right, what if we just try to go for, like, the... Oh, no, I, f I always forget the glasses there. I keep forgetting the glass panes. Oh, my gosh. Okay, I don't know what to go for. I was going to say, I know it's harder to land in some of these one-by-ones, but I think it actually makes the level easier after that. Landing in these kind of bigger areas... Seems to make the level a little bit harder. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on! Oh, I was literally holding W as hard as I flip it good. I need my eyeball back. That's what it is. That's what it's supposed to be. Three. Three for good luck. We'll put one right there, and we'll put two right there. Okay, my, my microphone is now looking like a uh, spider. Come on, my lucky eyeballs. Give me some luck here. Here goes nothing, boys. Here goes flipping nothing. Oh, my God. I will say that this dropper level is extremely tedious and probably one of the hardest dropper levels I have ever done just because like, oh my gosh, it's so difficult to get over to that. Oh my gosh, what the heck? This level is literally giving me a headache, guys. It is so flippin' difficult. I cannot explain. I am so close. <laughs> Gosh, this level is ridiculous. You know what? I'm not even going to try to go around the water. I'm just going to try to go straight through this glass. I think that's the best thing I can do is try to go straight through that glass. Eyeballs, I'm going to need your luck here. I'm seriously going to need some luck and some skill to make it through that glass. That is going to be so difficult to make it through that. Oh my gosh, that's like a 1 in 1,000 chance. You know how hard it is? Like, that's literally, it's just as difficult to make it through that glass as it is to perfectly land in a cauldron. I know this way might seem a little bit harder, you know, landing in this very narrow space, but I can't seem to get, pa I can't pan myself around that bottom part to land in the water, no matter how hard I try. Literally, for you to make this dropper, everything has to be flawless. Every move you make, every single turn has to be Literally flawless and look how close I'm getting to that. I guys, I cannot stress to you how difficult this level is. It might look somewhat easy, but holy mac and cheat. I've played a lot of droppers, but I've never played a dropper level this tedious and this difficult. <sighs> it's my time to shine. This is why they call me unspeakable. Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh my god. I guys. guys, I really hate to do this, but I cannot express to you guys seriously how difficult it is to make this dropper i have gotten that close 40 times over 40 times i've landed in that exact same spot i have tried so many different ways i <laughs> i don't want to give up but it's like i've been doing this level for 45 minutes Whew, all right well it's time to try a different tactic because i've been doing the same little routine going to that little side over there i've been doing that same little routine for the past 45 minutes and it doesn't really seem to be working but that almost flipping worked and i'm getting excited now you guys haven't seen me be doing it for 45 minutes because a lot of it has been cut out in the video obviously this level is seriously the hardest dropper level i've ever done in my life and i think it might be because the whole time i might have been going the wrong way it is just as difficult to make it through these glass panes as it is to land in a cauldron Imagine how difficult it is to get yourself in a cauldron from a thousand blocks away. It's not the most easy thing. Oh. 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 Oh my gosh! No flipping way! No flipping... Okay, okay, I'll admit I cheated a little bit. Okay, I shouldn't get too excited, but guys, I, I'm sorry. I had to break... Okay, I didn't fully cheat. I didn't fully cheat. I half cheated. I broke a little bit of the glass because, guys, making it through those... Flipping glass panes is literally, like I said, it's like landing in two cauldrons at once while you're kind of going at an angle because you're still kind of moving from the previous blocks up. This level was so incredibly difficult. Now, maybe I was just going the wrong way, but I literally tried so many different ways, and those two ways that I've been doing seem like the easiest. And guys, I've been doing this level for almost... Man, I've been doing this level for almost an hour. I just had to tweak it a little bit. I felt like it was impossible. You know, after doing this for so long, I feel like I was slowly losing my mind. And I feel like like the map creator didn't review this map. And I feel like he actually made it impossible. Okay, may maybe he didn't. I don't flip a note. But all I know is I beat it. I'm happy. What is this? Congratulations. You unlocked a new achievement. Core. Oh, wonderful. You know, 
After playing this level for so long, I need another cup of coffee. Wait, where's the green thing? Is it over here? There it is. Levels room. Wait, there's a level nine. Oh my god. There's more levels! I thought that was the last level. <laughs> I thought that was... Oh, oh, flip. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining because I really want to get to level 11, which is rainbow. But I just didn't know there was... I, you know, I just didn't know that there was more levels. But, you know, now, now we know. But hopefully this level is not as hard. Holy flip. Okay, this level doesn't look too bad. Honestly, as long as it's not what we went through in the last level, I'm not complaining. That last level was... Oh my gosh, don't even have me talking about it. This level has like a really long drop. Like I feel like I'm like falling like forever. Oh my gosh, it's really hard to get centered. It's really hard to get centered with this level. Oh! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All right, level 10. We only got two more levels, and our last level is the rainbow level, which uh, is definitely what we've all been waiting for. Oh, I hate that level. I'm going to blow it up with TNT after we beat this. Level 10, black and white. I don't know why I don't know why I had so much trouble with that other level. Like, maybe it was just me. Maybe. Oh, I, I, I absolutely hate these levels. I hate these levels because, like, it really messes with my mind. And, like, yeah. It, what the flip see I didn't even see that glass there because there's so much like black and white you can't even tell like what is what oh my gosh so it's basically this one you gotta land you gotta land in three spaces that are just one block so this block this block this block and then I don't know where to go but oh my gosh I was really hoping that was a slime block because like I, I saw carpet and like a lot of these levels whenever you see carpet that's usually a slime block but we flippin' made it, boys. Oh my gosh, we flippin' made it. The final level is the rainbow level. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna cry. I'm literally gonna cry. This better be an epic flippin' level because this is what I've been waiting for for a really long time. Oh my gosh, level 11 is rainbow. Oh, please don't be insanely hard. Rainbow levels are supposed to be fun and easy! But you know, this rainbow level has a different twist for us. What the flip is going on? This is really cool. Like, I like this level. This is really cool. Like, I like this level, but I can't tell what the flip is going on. So I think we got some... So it's pretty much just kind of straight down for the most part. Oh, oh, there it is. Look at that. All right. Oh, my gosh. Uh, final room. What? The final room. The quick fall to the final room was unlocked. What do you mean the final room was unlocked? Is there still another room? Oh, wait, no, that's... Oh, wait. Back to me. Oh, no, I guess that was the final room. I, uh, I'm, I'm so confused. Okay, well, guys, I want to thank you all so much for watching this video. Holy mac and cheese. Let's blow up level eight. You're the one that triggered me the most. So you're the one that's going down. Ah, here's level eight. Wow, look at all this... The redstone blocks. All right, give me a second, guys. Let me place a ton of TNT. Oh, we got a wall of TNT. Would you look at that? All right. Well, guys, I want to thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully, this sets off the chain of TNT going all the way to the top. Nope, that didn't do it. Okay, well, you know what will do it? You know what will do it? You know what will do it? Let's, let's, we got it. We got to set off the chain. We got to set off the chain. Something's got to set off the rest of this TNT. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Guys, thank you all so much for watching this video. There's, okay, I give up. Whatever. <laughs>